Right now, a Conyers congregation is looking for some restoration after a fire ripped through their church. Now, no one was hurt. That's good news there, but it's going to take a huge effort to rebuild what is now lost. 11 Alive's Tracy A. McPeer is live at the church right now with how that fire may have started. Tracy? Well, the fire department says they think it started near the sound booth on the second level of the sanctuary. And the pastor tells me they had just purchased new furniture, a new roof and new AC units when this happened. Well, I got a phone call that the church was on fire. And what I saw was like it felt like a nuclear holocaust. Right now inside XL Church, plastic is melted, chairs are burned and soot is covering almost every surface. It's just gone. Francis Smith. Nothing you can do. Has been the lead pastor of the church on Flat Shoals Road for decades and says Friday morning's fire destroyed it all. Everything here is it's a total loss. It's a total loss. Um, there's nothing salvageable here. Smith says they quickly made a plan to allow for services yesterday. We had 24 hours to pivot and get set up for the gym. And they'll continue to use the gym for services and food distribution until they rebuild. But Smith says they do have hope. Amidst all the destruction, there was one plastic table that was not burned, with Excel Church written on top. And they'll let me know that everything in here got burned except the church. The church is not the building. The church is the people. Now, Smith says it could take six months and five million dollars to rebuild. So over the next few weeks, they plan on holding a concert and fundraising online.